Now, if you have decided to be a pharmacy tech, you would wanna know the best way to start your career. And plus, you might have some questions like, do I need to get any training or can I just start applying for jobs? Do I need to go to college or enroll in local classes? What are the things employers are looking for in entry level pharmacy techs? But folks, you are at the right place because in this video, I'm gonna share with you the top five things you need to do to start your pharmacy tech career right away. By the way, I'm Landon, and if you are new here, you are watching Certified Success. And on this channel, we share tips and tricks to help you start your dream career faster. Y'all ready? How about we get started? Number one, enrolling in the right training program. As a pharmacy tech, you need some kind of formal education before you can start your career. Few companies do offer on-the-job training, but the salary is typically lower. Folks, we live in the age of competition. I mean, it is everywhere. Pharmacy chains and hospitals wanna hire the right people for the jobs. And the definition of the right candidate is someone who has some kind of formal training in pharmacy tech. So the first and most important step towards becoming a pharmacy tech is enrolling in a training program. Well, my friend, you are lucky because pharmacy techs do not need to enroll in expensive full-time on-campus programs at a university or a community college. Now, instead, we recommend enrolling in an online training program. With an online program, you should be able to get your pharmacy tech education from the comfort of your own home. Compared to full-time on-campus programs, online programs are significantly cheaper and faster. So more sleep, and more money. You can complete an online program in less than six months, while full-time programs can take up to two years. Two years, it's a long time. Ultimately, if you are looking for a convenient and affordable option, enrolling in an online program is the way to go. Number two, ensure your training is from an accredited source. Now, this one, listen people, this one is incredibly important. You need to ensure your pharmacy tech training is from an accredited source. Now, listen to me, just picture this. You are in an interview with the employer and they notice that you received your training from an unaccredited place or an organization that they have never heard of. Now that could raise huge red flags in the eyes of an employer. I mean like ex-girlfriend, boyfriend red flags. Sometimes students are tempted by local classes that are comparatively cheaper, but cheaper isn't always better. The problem is that they could create difficulty when seeking employment. Long story short, just make sure your pharmacy tech training is from an accredited source. Number three, getting certified from PTCB. As per a survey, a whopping 90% of employers require pharmacy techs to be certified. To get certified by the PTCB, you need to sit for an exam, and once you clear that, you are a certified pharmacy technician. This certification is recognized across the US, I mean, everywhere and you can put the CPHT title next to your name on that resume. Being a certified pharmacy tech or a CPHT is typically regarded as the gold standard across the industry, and it builds trust in your skills, the skills you've been building for a long time. Your training program should ideally prepare you for the certified pharmacy technician exam. Now, now listen, you could be thinking, all of this sounds good. Landon, it sounds amazing. But how do I find a program that is online from an accredited source and prepares me for the certification exam? Well, my friend, do not worry because we published a video on our channel where we share a step-by-step -step blueprint on how to become a pharmacy technician. Yes, you heard that right. Now, in this video, Grant Aldridge, our guy who is a well-known education expert, highlighted why the traditional on-campus programs do not make sense anymore and why online training is the way to go. I mean, things are changing. In this video, he also shares details about an online program for pharmacy techs that checks all of the right boxes. So if you were looking for the ideal training program to become a pharmacy technician, make sure you check out this video. Trust me, I will not lead you in the wrong direction. I, look, I know we just met, but I got you. I'll make sure to add the link below in the description and in the pinned comments, all right? Number four, you need hands-on experience. Now, if you wanna stand apart as an entry-level pharmacy tech, having hands-on experience could prove the key. As a beginner, you can enroll in a local externship and spend a few weeks working at a local pharmacy. Just think about it. There are two candidates, right? 
one who is a complete beginner, looks nervous, and has never worked in a pharmacy. Now, compare that to a candidate who has had a few weeks of real life, hands-on experience working inside a real pharmacy. Now, the candidate with the experience is likely to get preference. Now, typically, the majority of pharmacy techs do not care about getting hands-on experience when they are starting out their careers. So, after completing your training, you can find a local externship before you start applying for your job. And that is likely to put you miles ahead of the competition. I mean, way ahead. Number five, obtain your pharmacy tech license. Finally, the last step is obtaining your pharmacy tech license. Now the process for this varies from state to state, but if you have received your training and if you are certified, obtaining your state licensure as a pharmacy tech will not be a problem. It will be easy as cake. You can check with your local authorities or your prospective employer about the exact process to obtain the license. So people, there you have it. Those were the top five things that you need to do before you start your pharmacy tech career. Now, if you wanna start your career as a pharmacy tech in the next few months without student debt, then I highly, highly recommend checking out the video we have linked down below. This video eliminates all the guesswork and you will be on track to start your fascinating new career as a pharmacy tech in the next few months. You'll also learn about a training program that helps you find local externships so that you can get that hands-on experience. So go ahead, click the link down below and check out that video. What are you waiting on? Now, if you got any questions, drop them down in the comments below and make sure that you smash that like button. I hope this video gave you all some clarity on what you need to do to start your pharmacy tech career soon. And until next time, I'm Landon, signing off. Take care.